Welcome back to my channel and welcome to my first vlog of 2021. So I am very excited for this vlog. I know I say that every vlog, but that's because I like plan so many projects for each vlog. And I just get really excited because I have all this stuff that I want to do and then I get to share with y'all. So um, I am very excited for this vlog. So we will be organizing my vanity. We will also just be doing a few organizational things. Um, I have a new organizer coming in for my planner cart. And yeah, it's going to be a nice little organization vlog. I kind of just wanted to start this vlog and share everything that I have so far. So I ordered some trays from Ulta. And of course, I'll have everything linked below. But... Let me try and think of the best way to do this. Let me put my camera around. Currently working with, so this is my old desk that I use as my vanity. We have my mirror up here. And then um, I have only makeup brushes and different items that I'll go over later. I got some more makeup removers. This is some samples that I got with my orders. I just went to Target. I picked up a lot of like hair elastics and bobby pins because I don't know where all of mine went. I just grabbed several different ones and then yesterday I believe these organizers came in from Ulta and then I picked this one up at Target. And so, so here's everything that I ordered. So this is, this is the Onyx collection from iDesign from Ulta and again everything will be linked below. Um, these are from the same collection. I just as you know I look everything to match. So we have a cube organizer. So it's three drawers at different levels. This top drawer has a separator. And then we also have this wide cosmetics drawer. We have one large drawer and then two smaller drawers. We have coffee stains all over the vanity because this is where I get ready in the mornings and I need my coffee. And then this is really cool. So this is a palette organizer. Um, and then this is a like brush holder. So I'm not sure if I'm keeping the brush holder. I'm trying to figure out exactly where I want to put things. So for now, I'm gonna try and see if I can do without it and just place everything in here because I have more than enough room. I just bought it just in case. So I'm gonna open all these up and start placing items and then go over everything. So everything is finally nice and organized. So I'm actually going to keep the organizers stacked. Um, I didn't think I would, well, one, I didn't even know I could do it. And then um, I've tried separating them and I just really like having them stacked. So it might, you know, look a bit strange just having, you know, everything stacked on one side, but I honestly don't care. Um, I really like having them stacked. I feel like it's more functional. I like having everything in one spot. So this is the organizer and I am in love with this. So let's start from the top. So I'm just gonna place this down. So this is a Chanel makeup bag. Um, during the holidays, Nordstrom had a lot of gift sets. This came with a lipstick trio from Chanel and I love it. So I actually purchased this off of eBay. Um, people are just selling the bags and I want it to complete kind of the look that I was going for. The seller also included a chain because you can use this as a purse um, and pearls. I just really like the pearls on it so I kept the pearls on here. But this holds all of my older makeup. Um, so this just has all of my like other mascaras and then it's primarily like just some older mascaras. I threw away a lot of makeup at the beginning of the year 
And so there isn't a lot in here, but this just has some of the older items. And then in this first drawer, there is a divider. And so I have my mascaras on the right. And then I have all of my eyeliners on the left. And so I have a few from Chanel, my Urban Decay ones. And then I have this, um, this Urban Decay Lash Primer as a divider. So I do want to get some more mascaras. And so I want to save room for mascaras here because that's the main like makeup piece that I use. So I put the primers over here. These are all also <laughs> samples um, because I know I won't get any more eyeliners I don't wear as frequently. Um, and I have like each of the one that I need. I have a rolling pen, I have a pencil, I have a liquid, and I have a marker. So um, I don't need any more. And so I just kept the primers over here and separated with this one. And then in this next drawer, um, just very simple. This is the Chanel lip balm, hand cream, and then tweezers. And then here is just my bags of samples that I've received from all of my orders. And then underneath here is the extra makeup removers. So a few things to know if you're new to my channel, I don't use foundation or anything like that if y'all can tell by everything that i have here so i only wear eye makeup so that's another reason why i have so much room for all of this like extra storage in here um, i know probably most people would put like foundation and different stuff in here i also don't really wear lipstick or lip um, gloss um that's why i only have like the lip balm and then i do love eye makeup so i do have you know um, all of my eyeshadows, like the ones in here. So this top drawer is for day, and then the bottom is for night. And then I primarily just wear mascara and eyeliner. So that is why there's only eye makeup in here um, and a few other items. But in this compartment, we have all of my new brushes and then just the makeup removers that I'm currently using. And that is this little organizer, which I absolutely love. I absolutely love how it looks, how it matches, you know, the entire office and um, just the layout and the functionality of it. In here, nothing has changed, but I'll just do a quick run through. So I have my hair clips, brushes, um, my wand and my curling iron, bobby pins, hair ties. This is all my tool products. So, so like skincare, um, anything that I have to like wash my face with, I do keep downstairs. That's the only thing that I don't keep upstairs on my vanity. Deodorant and then all of my hair items that I'm currently using. And then in the ottoman is where I have everything else. So I have this hot tools organizer from Target and that has my straightener. And then the base for the curling wand and curling iron. This is the mixologist from Dry Bar. I have um, the travel case for our, the mixologist from Dry Bar, and inside of that has the wand. And then I also have the Dry Bar um, styling brush. So all of that is to the left. It's divided by the Game of Thrones makeup. And then I have the palette organizer. And this just has all of my eyeshadow palettes organized. Um, and then I have this Wonder Woman organizer with some extra Tula products that I mainly use in the summer. So that is everything in here and then that is all of my makeup and all of my hair products i do have some extra like hairsprays and stuff that i have downstairs but for the most part um this is everything that i actively use since i do get ready up here and i just really love how my vanity has turned out so this organizer just came in from amazon so this will be on my planner cart and i'm not exactly sure how i'm going to set it up but i do want to use it for extra storage since I have extra room. So we're about to place this on here and figure out how we're gonna use it. So here is the acrylic organizer from Amazon and right now I really like this setup. This is all the items that have kind of just been floating around my planner cart and my desk because they didn't really have a home. So up top we have an HP mini notebook and then the cloth and paper. Um, I believe they call it the spiral planner, spiral agenda. Um, and so I'm using both of these for school and so I've been keeping them in this little document holder from Erin Condren. 
However, I just want to have them easily accessible so when school starts, I can easily grab them. And so um, I'm just designating this like my little school spot. So I'm going to keep these two in here so they have a permanent spot. And then I have just my pens that I use every day, um, some of the uni pens. And then these are from Target. I absolutely love these sticky notes. I, need, I want to go back and grab some more. Um, I primarily use them for work. And then I have some other sticky notes and planner cards from cloth and paper that, that don't fit in my organizer. So nothing's really changed on my desk. So I still have, have these other sticky notes from cloth and paper. So they all kind of go together, save the urge to do memo and message. And so I have the appointment cards in my inbox um, sticky notes underneath, I believe these two. And so I just wanted to have like one sticky note per box and that way I can easily grab them. And so I'm keeping those in there. And then I put the inbox up here. So these are the inbox sticky notes from cloth and paper. And then I just have the appointment cards in here. And then I have a brand new um, unopened pack that I've just put in here as well. So I have a spot for that. And that way I can easily grab these as well. The appointment cards I don't use too frequently. I mainly just restock them in my planner. So they're fine just being in the drawer. And then this bottom drawer, um, is what I'm most excited about because I finally have a home for all of my, uh, my stickers. So these are my most used stickers. These are all of my top paper co, the planner spot and your everyday stickers. So I did like icon stickers over here and then like transparent dots in different colors over here just, just to add some functionality to it. And so these have definitely been the thing that floated around the most and so I'm glad that I finally just have a spot to store these and it's easy to grab. I like that it's up top because these are some of my most used items. So I wanna make sure that they're easily accessible, which is why I put this organizer up top. So that is how I'm using this. I don't plan on putting anything else up front just so I can open the drawers and I just wanna be able to use this. And then other than that, that is gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching.